Hey friends, welcome back to my channel Indian Mom Cooking. So I know it's been very long time since I upload a video. So I'm sure hereafter I'll be uploading one video per week. So today I'm going to share with you how to get a fluffy puri like this. So let's get started with the ingredients and how to make this uh, puri. So I'm just going to take a bowl in that I'm just going to add an about one cup full of wheat flour. So it's like 250 grams of wheat, wheat flour. So you'll be able to get uh, like seven to nine uh, medium sized puris. So to that I'm going to add about half spoon of salt. And mix all together with your hands. And add in water little by little. So I'm just going to mix all together and add water little by little. So you should be very careful while adding the water. So the dough should, the, the consistency of the dough should be little hard, not soft as while you make it for chapati. So I'm just adding water little by little and mixing it all together into a soft dough, like um, medium soft dough. So I'm just going to knead the dough like this for about 5 minutes so, so that you'll be getting softer, fluffier, chapat, I mean puri. So you can very well do this step for making chapatis. So my dough is ready. Now I'm going to add about like uh, 5 drops of oil and just going to rub, uh, rub it over the dough so that it won't get dry. I'm just going to close it and keep it for about 10 minutes. And after 10 minutes, it's time to uh, roll on the puris. So I'm just going to take a little ball size. It's like a size of a lemon. And I'm just going to dust it with the wheat flour again. And I'm going to start rolling it like this. So the um, puri should be like a little thick. Not so thick, it should be little thick. I'll just show you at the end how thick it should be. So we all uh, do the chapatis like a very thin. So for puri, it should be little thick. So yes, this is the thickness needed for puri so that you'll be getting layers. So I'm just going to start uh, rolling all the puris so as i told you for one cup of uh, flour you'll be getting like seven to nine puris medium size puris So this puri recipe is one of the favorite re uh, recipe for my kids. So they love to eat puri. So make sure to roll it like a little thick so that you'll be getting fluffy puris. So yes, I'm done rolling all the puris. Now I'm just going to put on into the oil. So while I'm uh, rolling out the puris, I just uh, heated up the oil. So make sure the oil is very uh, like hot enough. And turn the flame to medium and you can start putting out the puris. So as you all can see, soft and fluffy puri is ready. So this is how I make puris at home. Please do try this recipe and let me know in the comment section. So this is the most requested video in my Tamil channel. So I just did puri in one of my vlog. So and um, uh, many of you all requested uh, to do the puri recipe. So here I am with the recipe. So while putting puri, you need to do it uh, like this in the circular motion with your uh, spatula or the like the spoon 
in which you are going to take the puri so that it becomes uh, more fluffier and keep it for about 30 seconds on each side so yes the fluffy soft puri is absolutely ready to eat so you can very well complement puri with aloo gravy or uh, potato gravy or um, chana masala anything so yes puri is ready so i'm just going to taste it and uh, so it's very hot as you all can see still it's fluffy so i just made uh, potato gravy i'll be sharing with you the gravy uh, next week for sure it's very very easy and simple to make and um, it really complements well with the puri so you can see the layers so it's been like 10 minutes still my puri is so soft it's not hard it's very very soft so i'm just going to taste it along with the potato gravy so as a whole it just takes me about half an hour to make puris and uh, aloo gravy or potato gravy very very yummy kids love to eat them and i will be sharing uh, recipes one recipe each week for sure please do subscribe to my channel if you are new to my channel and i make videos related to cooking recipes in in this channel and have and i have separate english channel which in which i do vlogging uh, makeup and organizing and i do have a separate channel for tamil which is called as indian lifestyle Indian mom lifestyle Tamil so I will leave all the links in the description box and I do have a separate channel for my kids you can very well go and check out the links I'll, I've given all the links in the description box please do follow me on social network Facebook and Instagram thank you bye bye